Well, the beloved monarch butterfly is now listed as endangered as populations of the butterfly continue to decline. This is putting the monarch two steps away from extinction. 7 Action News reporter Brett Cass tells us what this means and the efforts underway to keep them around. Monarch butterflies are a sight of summer here in Michigan, and many people enjoy seeing them in their garden, but now their fate is at risk. They're beautiful. All butterflies, they make everybody happy. Inside Ray Wiegand's butterfly house in Macomb, nearly 12 different species are on display. None more recognizable than the monarch. Years ago, you've seen them everywhere, and now you just don't. Courtney Folk has worked here for eight years and has noticed the species decline. Here's an egg. That's what an egg looks like. For instance, eggs once cover the milkweeds inside the butterfly house, but have now become harder to find. Is there one thing in particular that's leading to the decline or is there a mix of things? Like what exactly is leading to this decline? That's a great question and I wish it was one thing because if it was one thing, it would be so much easier to deal with. Mark Hunter is a professor of ecology and evolutionary biology at the University of Michigan. He says climate change, pollution and disease likely all play a role along with a decline in milkweed due to pesticides. He studies the species at the school's biological station in northern Michigan. Over the last 15 years of working there, the populations have declined by about 80 percent. Hunter says the monarch is a major pollinator, helping farmers across the state. He hopes its new designation will spread awareness. This is truly a win-win both for the farmers of Michigan and for the general public if we can get this trend reversed. Besides just their impact on the environment, it's the impact on visitors at the Butterfly House that Folk sees the most. It's just happiness. That's what they do. Now, Ray Wiegand's Butterfly House is open every day except for Monday from 11 a.m. until 4 p.m. if you want to check out those butterflies yourself. In Macomb, I'm Brett Cast, 7 Action News.